Please don't tell me you're the one who arranged this fight. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh. I know we haven't spoken in a long time, but I need your advice. Is it really wrong to create false evidence to frame some criminals who you know for sure are definitely, absolutely, without a single shadow of a doubt, guilty? Well, I don't care what you say, Dad! I'm doing it anyway! Wrongly accusing the boys is one thing, but openly framing them is another. One more offense and you are fired. And you still owe these boys an apology. It's fine, it's fine. I'll apologize when fish start to walk. If this really is the kind of person you are, then we seriously need to talk about our relationship as well. I saw that coming. I glued everything to the floor. <laughs> Gotta be honest, Gumball. I'm not entirely comfortable committing a crime. Look, it's not a crime if you intend to get caught. Unless we actually do something bad, Simeon's gonna blow a fuse and lose her hairy boyfriend. Do you really want that on your conscience? Good, then give me a Lego. Now what am I supposed to do? Give yourself a Lego! Oh, of course. Don't. <laughs> this is going to be easier than I thought. I'll deface his car. Principal Brown! Principal Brown! Principal Brown! Principal Brown! Principal Brown! Dude, why is every single window broken except for Brown's? How about you do it yourself if you're such a hot shot? I caught them. I finally caught them. Which means I can do this. You're coming with me to the principal's office. With pleasure. Wait, we forgot to spray our names. What do you mean? <laughs> Duh, if we don't sign it, Principal Brown will think it's you again. Then you'll get fired and lose the love of your life. Now <laughs> where would that leave us? Are you trying to say that you only did this to save my reputation, my job, and my relationship? Of course, what do you take us for, some kind of criminals? <laughs>